Hey everybody, I'm bringing you another tutorial video today. This time we're just going to expand on a previous glitch that we did in the last video, uh, glitching things into walls. Uh, I posted some videos and pictures of things I've been working on in the uh, Palia housing discord channel and some people were asking for a vid, so here we are. Alright, as you can tell I got the um, <clears throat> I got one of the uh, bellflower tubs stuck inside the uh, the fireplace. Um, I also did the fountain, which I think looks really good. Uh, it glitches outside as well. So we got that going on. So it's a double whammy for that one. But it's really easy. You just got to make sure you have enough um, uh, rooms available, uh, <clears throat> build limit rooms available. So uh, you're going to need one. So you're going to be placing a room temporarily, so make sure you have that available to do this. So I'm going to pick this up so you can see it just glitched like normal. And then we're going to throw down a room. <clears throat> Any size uh, will work. It really doesn't matter. You just want to make sure it's big enough to uh, hold whatever you're doing. Um, I'm not only just doing this, I'm also doing these other items as well. Just so they go into the wall, they a little more snug. Um, but it's pretty easy, so I'm going to pick this up. And put this in here and this time we're going to use the baking oven and we just want to make sure that we're primarily uh, in between both houses we want to make sure that we're primarily in this room not the temporary room but the main room that you're working out of otherwise when you try to pick up this room <clears throat> it's going to uh, ask to pick up all items in the room and it won't work so just make sure the item is primarily in your main room they can overlap a little bit but yeah, here we go. So I believe that's right. So to check it, we just gotta go here, right click, it was fine, no error. So get the uh, fireplace, place it, and boom. Starting up, excellent. And you can interact with it and bake right out of your fireplace. Looks cool, at least I think so. Uh, what I really like though, is that they're, they don't glitch to the back either. So, from the outside, you can't even tell, which is awesome. <clears throat> so, you can use a number of different things. So, let me do one more. Doo -doo -doo. This is the one I did in Discord. <laughs> Place that there. H. Pick it back up. Place the room back down. Move the item out of the way. Pick up the new item. Looks good. Boom. There we go. Now we're filling the pot. Move it over a little bit, but but yeah, that's all there is to it. Um, this over here was done the same th same way. Put a room there on the other side of this wall. Place it here, mostly on this side. Uh, removed the other room and just made this a solid wall and boom. You got a nice fountain glitch between the wall. So it's pretty easy. You can get pretty creative with that as well. But uh, thanks for checking out the vid, guys. Bye.